Roll another. Do you, do you know what I really love though? Is like I just said I'm Germany. The guy that's joining as England's like I want to be your friend, but I'm a nothing. And he's just like I want to be your friend. You are Germany. Everyone just kind of like wants to like Germany, you know. But I want to kill everyone. Oh yeah. I want to create Greater Germany. I mean, thank you. Just have the power. You're pretty tough. Kind well, of likely to create Greater Germany, you'd have to invade Austria, but you know, that's yeah, not my business. That, that I know, I, I'm totally aware. You know, Prague and you know maybe Vienna. Prague, Vienna, Innsbruck, and Trieste, and boom, you've got Holy Roman Empire borders. If you surrender Danzig and Warsaw to like Sweden or some fuck. And then I go Brussels and Charleroi. Yep. Well, I guess and just Charleroi. Then, the then I go and Swiss to them off and then boom, and, you've got the whole and Roman not, Empire. not to forget Nancy and I guess I'll have to invade, invade a bit of um, Denmark and I would have to march uh, uh, I would have to as well we were never in the Empire no before. but Greater Germany is all about the German people anywhere that there's German people I invade there are no German people yeah there is no there's not there's, there's like, like yeah I know but that doesn't matter to me if there's like small Pockets of ethnic Germans. Nope. You're in. There's no German. We put a travel There isn't the Baltics. A travel ban on those. No, dude. There's actually in the Baltics. Illegal. Kicked out. Bye bye. Deported. I thought you were trying to be friends with me. Man, but you can't come keep doing these cops' bellies, <laughs> man. <laughs> I will shut those cops' bellies out. Oh, ethnic Germans in the Baltics. Oh, what? What? What ethnic Germans? You're just gonna Germany. That you gotta deport them to I'll Germany. Just deport them straight to Germany, baby. Back to their homeland where they came give, from. Give me free soldiers. <laughs> We're gonna build a wall and make you pay for it. Then I'm Germany. Wall. Ten feet <laughs> higher. You know what really? You know what really pisses me off? What what grinds your gears, Germany? Sorry, what? Oh yeah. Um. Yeah. No, I get it. I get it. You can see sort of Sweden's army, right? It's kind of fucking ridiculous. They're more powerful than us both. I know, exactly. But that's not it. You know what? You want to bet none of that is going to transfer to England? And he's just going to leave it there? Yep. That's what's really triggering me. Because then England's going to have jack shit. Yep. And then you're going to be sitting here ultra-industrialized. I'm going to sit here as a shithole. And wait, actually, gonna wait, 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 I have an idea. What You've I, got resources, right? I produce some resources in some quantities, yes. As soon as I get, uh, whatever, colonial armaments, you, you, you provide me your army. Give me your army. <laughs> Not bad idea, Tuvarish. But then I'm like, wait, the Ottomans can do the same thing. Yeah, and they're better. But wait, wait. What is what is Austrian? What's your tech? Let me check your tech. Is I think your tech more industrialized than us? Actually, so yeah. I'm currently I four, meaning I have a yeah. thirty already limit. Yeah. Okay. That's... Multiple yeah. times. Yeah, the Turks are multiple times more industrialized than Russia. We no, just but it's... make resources and export them. That's about all we do. Yeah, yeah but you. you... Who cares? Like, you just gotta st wait. Is there a limit? I was wondering on barracks. Nope. No, nope. build as many as you want. Russia doesn't have any of hers activated right now. But can I build but, them yeah. even in um even in my colonies? I think Russia would kind. Of, I mean, they'd have to sort of do that to get some power going, you know. Yeah, but um, I think it goes along with like tech system. There can't be like more than ten units. Yeah, no, but th there's a tech to get rid of that, so. Okay, so. Uh, uh, yeah. Also, um, is Rick here? Yeah, Rick is here. Rick! Rick! Rick, please, God, listen to me. He's l listening, but he ain't speaking. Damn it, listen to me. Rick! 
This is your flag, or you're going to be a Russian vassal. You got it? Good. I'm glad we came to an agreement. I gotta agree, it's a pretty sexy flag. That is your flag. Like, I'm, I'm willing to support... To that support is your support. flag! Be realistic, come on, that's the legit flag. That is your flag, boy! Guys, should I do something totally radical? What, man? You gonna have a world revolution? No, I mean, I could totally go Karl oh, Marx wait, and no, I'd be that wait, far wait. away. Send him to us, I have plans. Uh, never mind. Well, he's, he's technically in France right now, but... Yeah, but I... But I, like, I, have, I mean, since growing up as a little boy right now... Well, no, he's not born yet. 1897. Come on, almost. No, but, like, serious, though. Should I do something totally radical? What's your what? What do you plan to do? Well, I no, I totally could, but I don't want to. Maybe I mean I could do an alternative, but right now I have um, permission from uh, my boy Rick to um, have um, CSA uh, members assassinate Bismarck, Wilhelm the First, and Frederick the Third. Kill the German monarchy. No, well, no, Wilhelm the Second would still be alive. It'd kill, but you'd kill all of them. But why? To make you hate the society? No, because Wilhelm the Second can then go radical, like absolutely radical, like kind of want to dominate everything to make sure America never comes, kind of dominate. I understand that, but like, like being realistic. So, like, you're gonna do Order sixty six on your entire German um, Hohenzollern royal family. So that the Americans won't invade you? No, it's it's even better. I just want Wilhelm II to be so radical, so I can do what I want, basically. Okay, so you because want, you want him to be a psychopath? Basically. No, not really. Because I want him to do something that's out of the box of what all the German monarchs would do. If that well, makes the sense. German monarchs are generally generally the stereotype. Is that they have their cute little arms races with exactly. the French, and then they have but, their war, and then they ass rapes, and then it's Nazism, and then they get ass raped again, and then they shut up. So we have to change Exactly, that. so what I want to do is have the arms race, have the war, but not lose the war. You see that's what called, I'm going? You know, that's called Kaiserreich. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh. we, we were just it doing is. that RP, baby. Wait, hold on. Really? I have an idea. Okay, so... so. Yes. We can we can turn it into Kaiserreich and then invite DFC. <laughs> but then I'd have to give up Russia. So he. Oh my God! I'm gonna be Tatiana. Oh my God! <laughs> no, no, don't do that. No, DFC already hates you. I love the guy. No, he's gonna be really salty. See, Bill, you stole my RP idea. Uh, but like, I am, I am technically Tatiana's granddaddy. In the words. No, I. I mean. In the words of Desolator General, uh, Tidiana. I don't know. Because technically, like, in actual actual dates, like, Wilhelm I, Frederick III, both die, and Wilhelm III comes to the throne right around now. And then Otto von Bismarck gets sacked by Wilhelm II because he's like, fuck that guy.